Hello, I'm Helen Bradley. Welcome to this video tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to download, install, and use my 2014 calendar templates for Lightroom. Before we get started, let's have a look and see what it is that we're talking about. This is a calendar page that I've printed from Lightroom and I've added my own image to a calendar template and these are the calendars that I'm giving you. So you'll find you'll get calendars for all 12 months of 2014 and the calendars look pretty much like this. And then you can go and add your own image to the Lightroom template. So you need to know how to download and install not only these calendar images but also the template. And then I'll show you how to get started creating your own printed versions of these calendars. You'll need to start on my 2014 Lightroom Calendar Templates page. I'll give you a link to that page in the description for this video in case you haven't found it yet. The first thing you're going to do is type your email into this box here. Now this will sign you up for my email mailing list but you'll get a email asking you to confirm that you're happy with that. If you're not happy just don't click to say that you're happy with it but you can still download the templates. I just encourage you to sign up for my email newsletter so that you can hear more about the tips, tricks and tutorials that I publish on Lightroom, Photoshop and other applications. So I've typed my email address in here. If you're already on my list you won't get a second invitation to join but you will still need to type your email in here and then click to download. When you do that the download will then start. And here is the download taking place. It's just a very small download and on my computer once it's downloaded it launches and opens up. So here are the contents of this file. There are calendar images for the 12 months of the year. There's a calendar template and some instructions. So the first thing that you want to do is to extract the files. So I'm just going to click to extract them. I'm going to show the extracted files when complete because this just makes life a little bit easier and click extract. Once they're extracted from the zip file we can then do something with them. Now obviously the text file of instructions has instructions for you. If you need to remind yourself as to how to do all of this, go and look at the instructions. But for now I'm just going to close down all these websites because what we want to do is go to Lightroom. Now inside Lightroom I have a folder called Helen Calendars and I've dropped 12 images into it. These are the images I'm going to use for the calendar. And this particular calendar takes 6x4 images. So anything in that sort of realm, it'll take larger or smaller images, but 6x4 is the ideal sort of dimension. So obviously you're looking at a landscape image. So I've created a collection for my calendars. But right now let's go back and let's first of all import into Lightroom the calendar months because we need to do that as a first step. So I'm going to click on Import. And then I'm going to go and locate the folder that I just created when I unzipped those files. So they're going to be in my Helen Downloads folder. I don't want to include all subfolders right now but I do want to open Downloads so that I can find my calendar templates. And here they are here. So these are the 12 calendar templates. Um, Lightroom's just catching up with us here now but I'm not going to worry too much about waiting to view them. I'm just going to import them into Lightroom. And this is going to be in a new folder. That's going to appear in my folder list. Right now again I'm not too concerned about where they're going. I just want to grab all 12 of them and I want to add them to my collection. So I'm just going down to open up the collection I've created. I'm just going to drag them into the collection so that now I should have 24 images in my calendars collection. I've got the 12 photos I want to use and now my 12 imported calendars. These calendars are part of what goes together. We're going to put an image and a calendar together on a page. Now the page itself is also in that download 
and you'll need to install it into the print module. So I'm going to click on print to go into the print module and I'm in the template browser here. So I'm going to add a new folder for them. So I'm going to click new folder. I'm going to call this 2014 calendar and click create. And inside this folder, I'm now going to right click and choose import. And we're going to import the LR template file that we downloaded into the folder and unzipped into that folder in our downloads. So I'm just going to click here and click open. And that installs that into Lightroom. And this is what you get. It's a space for an image and a space for a calendar. So you're just going to go back and grab one of these images and put it into the calendar. So just drag and drop it into position. And now let's go and get January's calendar. And we're just going to drag and drop that in here. And you can see that's as simple as it is. And it's ready now to print. Now I've got my computer set up for printing to file. So I'm just going to click to print it to a file. And now I'm going to find a location for it. So I'm just going to drop it into my documents folder. So let's just go to my documents and I'll just add it in here. I'm just going to call it January and click Save. And it's now saved as a JPEG image in my My Documents folder. And I would go ahead then and create February. So I'm just going to drag and drop February's onto top of the January one because that will replace it automatically. Let's go and get an image for February, drag and drop that into position. And I'm ready to print. If I wanted to print to a printer, I would take the print job and set it to print to printer instead of print to file. And then I could click to print it to my printer. But that's as simple as it is to create calendars using this LR template file and the 12 monthly calendars that I've given you in the zip. I'm Helen Bradley. Thank you for joining me for this video tutorial. Look out for more of my tutorials on this YouTube channel and consider subscribing to the channel and you'll be alerted when new videos are released. And visit my website at projectwoman.com for more tips, tricks and tutorials on Lightroom, Photoshop, Photoshop Elements, Illustrator and a whole lot more.